for this week, we're going to highlight uh, what we call that a major index movement, particularly for uh, across the Asian market. Now, uh, the first one will be the FTSE uh, Asian 40 benchmark index. So if you look at our previous uh, reading, we highlight that the, we expect the index will continue to trade higher. It was indeed trade higher, but it fell short to hit our initial target at 11,000. Uh, regardless, the subsequent consolidation or corrective move was small. And you can see it has built a new baseline within 38.2 Fibonacci level. Um, we think any downside risk could be kept, uh, particularly within this long-term uptrend line. So the support here uh, should be within at 10,220. And 10,400 is pretty much uh, our downside risk as well. We're expecting the, uh, the index to continue upward once the correction uh, ended. Uh, for Malaysia market, let's take a look on the KSCI index. We're using weekly chart based on our earlier reading. We expect the recovery uh, despite the news was pretty bad at that time. Um, the, this, the what we call that the support or the double bottom pattern was uh, formed and it was actually uh, breaking out above the short term uh, mid or medium term downtrend line earlier. Now, um, overall momentum remain on the upside. Uh, if there any pullback, we think uh, it was likely going to create a new high low structure. As for now, we retain our positive view on KSI as we expect it continue to trade higher, at least over the medium term. So we put our target is actually at 1,500 and 1,540 uh, for medium to long term, while the support has been revised slightly higher at 1,400 and 1,370. Um, on the small cap, uh, for simulation small cap, it does look pretty good. As per our earlier highlight, uh, we expect it to uh, re recover. While it was uh, indeed recovering, surging past above our immediate resistance at 15,300, uh, now turning into our support level, we think the uh, small cap index has built a new baseline. Last Friday gain on the back of uh, breakout move on the SI here, signal a continuation of the ongoing uptrend. So we expect the small cap index to trade higher, seeking to next target at 15,750 and 16,000 while the support will be at 15,350 and 15,165. For JCI, based on our early expectation, the index did trade higher but fell short to break the immediate resistance at 6972, which is considered quite strong resistance. So despite the pullback, we believe the index going to build a new baseline before eventually retesting those level again. So we expect a short-term consolidation before um, uh, what we call that once the selling pressure ended, we expect the index continue uh, to trade higher. So the IDX JCI uh, target will be at 6972 and 7128. While uh, for IDX sector financial, the ongoing recovery is set to continue despite the short term consolidation uh, for the past few weeks. So a breakout above uh, 1442 could actually kickstart a new up cycle as we expect the next standing target is actually 1565. For uh, Philippine TSA index, uh, earlier expectation that the index goes higher was uh, was validated, but the upside was capped, particularly we need an immediate assistance at 67100. So we are seeing a strong resistance over here. So we expect the ongoing correction to continue as the stock, uh, sorry, as the index could actually testing the 61.8 Fibonacci level at uh, 6,250. So short term correction could actually continue further. Meanwhile, for Vision Index, the rebound that we expected earlier was kept within our resistance. As the index continue to trade, what we call that a new low low structure, we think they're going to re-challenge the immediate support again. So any reversal move within the immediate support could actually seem at the uh, attractive entry point. So watch out for any reversal within the support zone uh, at 8920 and 8700, uh, 8, while the resistance at 9375 and 9720. For Singapore, SCI index has to continue to trade higher. Uh, our early expression was uh, validated after the index take out our immediate resistance, um, but fell short to create a new high at 3350. Uh, regardless, the subsequent correction could actually continue, but the downside could be kept. We're expecting um, what we call a uh, reversal signal right within the support level. So once selling pressure end, we expect the uptrend to continue retesting the major resistance again. So for IHS re-index, um, the recovery was kept. The downtrend still pretty much intact. Uh, as you can see, the index continues to slide below 88 day moving average, creating a new low high structure. So we're expecting the index continue to test uh, again the immediate support, which we think it considered strong as for now. It has been tested at least one, two, three, and ongoing four. So a breakout above this level could actually extend the uh, further decline, but we think this uh, there could be a buying interest emerge within particular support. So watch out for the 
or we could uh, reverse a signal within 1090 and 1070. Uh, for Thailand, ACT index, the breakout above the uh, downtrend channel has kicked start a new up cycle, but the buying uh, interest, there's no strong follow through. So we're expecting a new consolidation uh, within this uh, particular support. Right within 1503 and 1487, and once uh, send pressure end, we expect it continue to trade higher. And the next technical target is actually paired at 1570 uh, and 1610. While the uh, my index for um, small cap in Thailand, you can see the downtrend is actually ongoing, but there's a number of rejection occur right within a key support for now. We're expecting some sort of technical rebound at least near term with the next technical target pack at 505 and 555. Um, for Vietnam, uh, the index continue to trade higher. Uptrend remain pretty much intact despite the hanging man pattern. Uh, the trend structure still uh, ongoing. So we expect the index to continue to trade higher at 1247 and 1300. While for Hanoi share index, uh, the uptrend also uh, expected to continue uh, much more further. The next target is actually back 263 and 285. <laughs> Thank you.